make amazing jabs. Evil to hope. You want legit. Okay, what's the, what's the, what's the magnitude legit? <laughs> like it really depends. Like for example, here I'll give you one example. Uh, one of the, uh, the places that where I went, wow, that's pretty serious money. Uh, in 1992, I believe, I went to a comic book convention. I was I was collecting comic books, and I was, and prices were going pretty high. So I decided to sell some comic books. So I got a table at a Toronto uh, comic book convention right set up a table and i was buying valiance early on i loved them no one was buying them. i was buying them i bought multiple copies and all of a sudden the prices went through the roof and i decided okay they've gone up a lot at that time they moved like insane relative to any other comics right like really relative to any other comics these things were moving like bitcoin level insanity right like a comic that you had bought like you know four months ago six months ago for two dollars or three dollars 225 or something was now selling for a hundred right so I went, okay i need to you know liquidate so i can buy some more buy different diversify right so i went to this convention paid i think at the time 300 dollars for the table got a friend of mine to help me out and i took my comics and it was 300 or 400 i can't remember maybe 250 i can't remember like 1992 just imagine right set up two tables doop, doop. I, I took a corner i paid a little extra to get the corner so i got the corner people were walking in on top of my comic book thing i wrote valiance 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 right okay it was a weekend convention two days right and i was in high i was in university at the time keep this in mind this was university right so i set up the booth and at the end of the, the weekend, I had around four and a half thousand dollars cash in my pocket, two days, right? So made four and a half grand cash, right? For a student in 1992. Plus, I had traded a whole bunch of comics that, like, I traded some Valiance and got some ec comics some of the ec comics that we read i got those for free basically not free but for trade for valiance but the valiance i bought for two dollars right and i bought some comics and stuff like this so four and a half grand four and a half thousand in cash plus let's say another two grand in comics right so six and a half grand in comics for two days doing something that i absolutely love doing okay with a friend and he did it as a favor i didn't even pay him i didn't know what to pay like we're we're students in university like i would have to go for a hundred dollar extra student loan emergency loan to be able to buy food to eat that, that's my university right there's multiple times i have to go f get a hundred dollar special loan right and that whole thing cost me let's say four hundred dollars for the table Let's say five hundred dollars for a table, whatever. Five hundred dollars for the table, and about a hundred bucks in comic books. Hundred bucks? No, let's say two hundred bucks in comic books. Two dollars a pop, that would be a hundred comics, right? So six hundred dollars made over six grand. That's legit for a university student for a weekend. 